Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. With the undeniable popularity of Black Panther has come a resurgence in exploring African culture and ancestry. So we connected with our friends at AfricanAncestry.com to find out more about our African heritage. Take a look. I'm excited to do the African ancestry testing for more reasons than one. I did do uh, something similar some time ago and I really want to see how accurate are these tests. It will be very interesting to see the, the longer lineage of what is really in, what makes up the Selena Johnson. <laughs> Who am I? <laughs> That's where I'm be Asian, yeah, I don't, I don't know. When I look at the map of Africa, I'm always very curious to see which country I came from. What do my people look like? What type of food do they eat? What, culturally, what do they do when people are, are born and when people die? What ceremonies? Like all of those types of things that were stolen from us. With these gaps in our teeth, we all thought we came from the Gap 2 tribe, but nobody even told us really, where is the Gap 2 tribe? I know they exist in Africa somewhere, but we don't know if they're from the top, the bottom, east, west, but girl, nobody knows. I literally do not know. And I don't think many black folks do. I just know that uh, the richness there, there's a part of me that uh, needs to know what that is. It would just be interesting to know which tribe I, I come from because right now I can't tell them nothing. Um, there's so many questions about who I am, why, how did we become, um, why we do certain things, why do I look a certain way, um, my eyes, my lips, my, my, my nose, my teeth. All of those are questions that have never been answered. In knowing where you originally come from, uh, as far as culture-wise, bloodline-wise, I think it can also tell you a little bit about yourself. For many of us, the majority of us who, who live in this country or wherever, we're taken uh, so viciously from our, 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 our homes hundreds and hundreds of years ago, uh, we'll know now where we were supposed to be. We will become empowered if we really know who we are and where we come from. Um, because, you know, we have been broken down as a race. We've been broken. Uh, and even uh, in our sensitive, sensitive state of being broken, we're still really strong. But I think when you know your origin and where you derive from and who you really are, that gives you strength and it empowers you. Oh man, we were into that. Oh, we <laughs> wow. Ooh. Tomorrow. Ooh. It's gonna be a big day. day. Yeah. It's gonna be a big, yeah. big day. And we didn't shoot those together, so we have it's, it's beautiful to see what you ladies had to say and like Wow. Tomorrow, uh, Gina Page from An AfricanAncestry.com will be with us to reveal our results and we're we are in like real, true anticipation to find out who we are. Man, we've yeah. witnessed our whole lives. Child, my sisters is like, oh good. Now we can find out. <laughs> now we out can know. We, <laughs> <laughs> now we just needed one person to just go and be the yes, guinea pig for all yes, the tests. Yes, we've been waiting on these uh, results for a minute. Why yeah. does that bring why is it so emotional for you, um, Kiana? Because there's a lot of unanswered questions. And then, you know, what my grandfather, we, does, we don't know who his father was. There's just a lot of unanswered questions. Mm -hmm. And it would be good to just say, aha, that yeah. explains this. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It explains that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Man. Mm -hmm. Well, I heard that this test is, is de definitely specific. Mm -hmm. That's what I love about it. Because yeah. I'm not going to say what the other ones said. We'll say it tomorrow. Mm -hmm. But I want to see if it's going to all kind of coexist with yeah. one another. Yeah. be the same right. thing. Man. It makes sense. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. uh, most of us can trace our roots back to, to, to the states. Yeah. Mm -hmm. right. that, that's as far as I got. I yeah. got to North Carolina, my, my mom's family, North Carolina, South Carolina, and then Pennsylvania. Mm -hmm. Right. What else do you all know about uh, your families? Well, um, I know that my grandmother was from Louisiana, mm -hmm. and um, my dad is from Hot Springs, Mississippi. Mm -hmm. So, so my so my mom theoretically her people were from Louisiana and mm -hmm. Creole and, and all of that. So my my grandmother's mixed with white. Yeah. So I'm very interested to see right. like, who my great grandfather was right. and who like that's a whole bloodline of white people yes and if your family was wow. anything like my family there was a lot of conversations that were not had like mm -hmm. when you don't know whose daddy was really her father mm -hmm. and this and that and other so it was a lot of discussions that you just like well who is his daddy 
Yeah. Y'all don't know who the people that is. Girl, <laughs> well, my, <laughs> girl, my grandfather had, my grandmother had my grandfather when she was 13, mm -hmm. and it was said that she was raped. Mm -hmm. And her rapist was supposed to be a white man mm -hmm. and all those things. And at that time, in 1913, it's very possible. Oh, yeah. So yeah. there was a lot of, so getting past that, we would never know who, yeah. but who, who was who. Yeah. And it's not like the rapist say, like, I did it. You know what I mean? Yeah. And it's like, she was ashamed. She didn't say anything. Yeah, we, so, get, yeah we get to we find, get to out, find like out. And past that, yeah. you just don't have any answers. Yes. Yes. So uh, tomorrow is the big day. Mm -hmm. um, AfricanAncestry.com. We're going to be uh, really excited to to get the uh, the big reveal. Yeah. Yeah.